What's up guys, so we were going up to girls on the street and asking them why do they think women struggle with dating? We're gonna get some really dumb cringy answers and also some surprisingly good insightful answers, so let's jump in. Before we get into the video, you might ask yourself, why in the world would we be talking about women struggling with dating? Isn't dating just hard for men? But believe it or not, every single year, there's more and more single women out there. And men, and some of that is by choice, but also a lot of that is girls who can't seem to find a good relationship. So we want to go out on the street and ask girls why they think their gender is struggling. And it was a good call because you're about to find out why. Why do you think women struggle with dating? I think a lot of girls, I feel like, have a false perception and they expect the most from guys when every guy is different. The saying where it's like, if he likes you he would or whatever that whole saying it's yeah. like every guy is raised differently not everyone has the finances to support maybe like if you want flowers every fucking sunday i think our expectations are high for sure like but the, the internet for sure has set like really high expectations so. yeah i think you're right about yeah. that would yeah. you say there's anything more to it than that or at least from my experience i think a lot of men come up to us but like cat calling instead of like coming up to us like hey yeah. how are oh, you okay. they, yeah. don't, they don't know how to approach the right way maybe they like so they just scream from the side of the street yeah that <laughs> Yes, over here. As we're walking. Yeah. We're just asking girls, why do they think women struggle with dating? Like, why do you think there's a lot of single women out there? We don't struggle with that. Well, it's not you, it's just in general. Are you? Men can be toxic, just like women can. So do you think it's because the women themselves are toxic or because? I hate this. I'm sorry. I have to watch this. Because men don't give us what we want. That's why. Men are liars. Let's also remember that one. Well, what's the question? Men are liars. Why? Because men can't settle down. <laughs> they, yeah, they always want more than one. What about in terms of the woman's part? Like, what do you think maybe some women might be doing wrong? Emotionally not available. Sometimes they ask for too much. They think these men are they dads. They want. They want the man to do everything for them, and then they do not. You know. That's true, especially Miami. Yeah, yeah, especially Miami. I think that a lot of women have have a very high level of what they think their man should be, mm. but they don't bring anything to the table. That's a good answer. Do you agree with that or do you, do you have a different opinion? I'm single, so I think a lot of it has to do with women are put in positions of having to do it all, but we don't want to do it all, but now it's time for the men to step up. When you say do it all, what do you mean specifically? At a very young age, I make a lot of money for my age. Uh. I don't pride myself on that. Like, uh. women can do it all, but I don't want to do it all. Yeah. I want to build with my man. I want to have a family. I don't I don't want to have to be in the front lines of fucking making all the money, dealing with other men. This is a man's world, so. So you, you want a more like traditional type yes, of relationship absolutely. where the guys like, where I can be in my feminine, yeah. I can just live in my royalties. Oh, cool, that's a good answer. No, I think that a lot of younger women have been sold a lot of bullshit, and and what I mean by that is they're told to get a career, and I tell her your number one priority should be a husband, mm. not your career. Mm. Your career doesn't keep you warm at night when you're 60 years old. Girls say there is no good guys and guys say there is no good girls. So. Social media. So you think like social media is fucking girls up? Uh, everybody. Okay. It's fucking everybody up. Interesting. Nobody can be normal and social media be there because everybody is just at your fingertips and you just have like a whole world of anybody. And so do you think social media is giving people too many temptations? Yeah, absolutely. Is absolutely. there anything else you think that contributes to it? I think social media is the biggest. I would be fine if my man had no social media. If you're like going out with a guy you don't know though, would you be like sketched out if you didn't have social media? No. Okay, you don't Not care? at all. Interesting. I would be happy. Girls can be difficult, so that might be a reason. I will agree with you on that. That might be a reason, but sometimes girls are just single because they want to be single. You know, they're just, you know, having fun, traveling around, meeting different guys. So, right? Okay, cool. I don't know, because guys are like, not that, like hard to date. So you think it's like being basically mostly the guys? Yeah. Like, okay. Do you think there's anything maybe women are doing wrong or no? Not that I know of. Okay, cool. Maybe commitment. I think so too. Like commitment. commitment. Yeah. Like finding somebody that is able to commit to uh -huh. only them. Uh -huh. Loyalty maybe? Right. So do you think that people like nowadays are less loyal than they used to be like 20, 30 years ago? Oh, definitely. I would say yes. Yeah. Okay, I would agree with that. There's... I think everyone just wants to party. Okay, so you okay. think like people just have different like uh, priorities? Right. Okay. Right. Fair enough. Because I believe that men have lost the value of what it means to be a man. Like here in Miami, they're just, people just want to do drugs and like party and they just want to hook up. Mm. They don't want to have like an established girlfriend with values and meet the family and all of that. They just mm. want to like, let's go with the flow. Mm. Like they say now, let's just go with the flow. So you would say it's like a lack of traditional values? Yes. Why do you think women struggle with dating? 
Manyan. Wait, don't, don't, don't cock block. You don't struggle, lady. Yeah, we don't struggle. We can't like the quality, the main quality around me. <laughs> okay. They don't want anything serious, I think. So the guy, they don't or the guys don't? I think the guys. Right? Okay. Why do you think women struggle with dating? Well, uh, because you guys are the worst. Wow. We're being told what to do on social media, mm. but that's not always the right case. So for instance, recently I um, dated a guy who in the beginning said he wanted to like, he's like, I think I'm old school, you know, because everybody's talking to three people at the same time. Why not just focus on one and make it work, right? Mm. Six weeks later, I asked him, hey, are you just talking to me? He got all upset, said I was interrogating him and ended it the next day. So if you were to sum it up, would you say it's uh, basically a lack of traditional values or a lack of values in general? Yeah, definitely, definitely. Do you yeah. feel like it's gotten worse or better over time? Worse, I've been single for like four years now. Do you I'll feel like it was easier like uh like maybe 10 years ago no not even then either because 10 years ago i was single in 09 and that was when like online dating kind of first started uh -huh. i think that's just what started it is the accessibility everybody definitely thinks that there's something better mm. you know that you can continue to find something better kind of like the grass is green on the other side yeah.